Hey, how's it going? Chris here. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to get started with Nostra. Okay, so Nostra is a decentralized social network, uh, but really it's just a simple way of sending notes. That's how it explained it. Notes are what we call short messages. And the real benefit of Nostra is if you understand how today's internet works, where essentially whenever you send a message, you're sending it between some cloud infrastructure that's highly centralized and often owned by one company. With Nostra, you can set up what's called relays and your relays send messages in between you and other people on the network. And the cool thing about relays are that they're really easy to run such that anyone can run them. You could run one at home on your Mac if you have some Linux software, basically. It's pretty easy to get started. Um, and that makes it more decentralized and censorship resistant because two people can communicate and really have an unlimited way of getting your message across without having any interruption. All right, now let's get started using Nostra. So there's a variety of different websites that you can use to start. One that I like is iris.to. So come here and it's really easy to get started with Nostra. All you need to do is pick a, a name or a handle that you want. So I could just say Chris Kastig this or even just Kastig, <laughs> whatever you want to do and press go. Boom, you're using Nostra. <laughs> so what did I just do? Essentially, I entered into the social network, kind of like entering into Twitter. What happened is uh, now that I'm in here, I can follow people if I want to follow someone like Edward Snowden, Jack from Twitter, Lynn, and I could read other people's notes. So you can see other people are posting notes, right? I could send a direct message. So all pretty basic social media stuff, right? Uh, in addition, I can go to my own page, which is up here and type my own messages just like that. I can edit by page by going up here and editing a profile, uh, and send messages and all that kind of stuff. Now we've come this far, but you might be wondering, where's your password? All right, you just put in a username that you made up yourself. Well, when you sign up, as we did, you're given a username and a password, only it's called private and public keys. So your private keys are going to be the way that you can come back to this account or the way that you can bring this account to other Nostra apps or clients or what they're called. So to do that, you wanna to go to settings, account, and then copy your NPUBs. Your NPUB is your public key. This you can share with people. Your private key, you'll also wanna copy this and save this somewhere. Your private key is just for you. You never wanna share it. Danger, danger, right? Um, but essentially, if this is totally a new concept, public key is like your username, private key is kind of like your password. Well, now that you got set up with your Nostra account, you followed a few people, and you have your private and public key saved, now we can go and do some extra things with Nostra that are pretty cool. Check out nostra.directory, and here you'll be able to sign in with Twitter and see of all the people you're following on Twitter, how many of them have moved over to Nostra. So I'm able to sign in and see a list of people. These are all people I follow on Twitter, and I can copy their pub key, and just go to Iris, and you can just put it after that, put the pub key up there, and it will bring you to that person's site, and now you can follow them, just like that. Nostra.directory is also a great place to list yourself. You can tweet your Nostra public key by clicking here, and then do it on Nostra as well, and that will make sure that other people will be able to find you. Now that we have a Nostra account, we can go to other clients like nostrachat.io and import our Nostra account. So I'm gonna come here, I'm gonna paste in my private key and immediately I'm thrown in a chat channel. So these are also notes and they're just being formatted in a different way to be used for a chat essentially, which is pretty cool. In addition, remember that Nostra is a protocol. So if I were to DM, let's say I DM Bitcoin Magazine on Iris, because my account is linked across sites, now those DMs are also on Nostra.io. The really amazing thing about Nostra is that when you send messages, you're sending them through relays. And some of these relays are public, meaning that if you want to have redundancy when you're sending your message to make sure it goes through as many relays as possible, you can come to nostra.watch 
and find public relays that you can use to send your message through. All you need to do is essentially just copy the relay here and then come to a client like Iris, go to settings, network, and you should be able to add a new relay just like that. Finally, when you were given your public and private key and you made a copy of them, it may have occurred to you that copying them and then pasting them into every single site you use could be not the safest thing to do because essentially you're trusting this person, this site, whoever this is, not to really, you know, hack you or sneak, sneak a copy of it themselves, right? And so for that, what you want to do is use an extension. Albi at getalbi.com is one of the more popular extensions that you can use. And once you have your public and private key saved in the extension, you'll be able to just simply log in with one click into all of the Nostra sites you want. So the way you would want to set this up is create a new account, go to settings, and then you can just paste in your private key. If you just put in your private key, it will know your public key, just like that. Make sure we're all saved. Looking good. And so now, even if I sign out of yours, log out. Yes, we copied our private key. Now I should be able to log back in just using private key access. Oh no, not even that. We want the Nostra extension login. There we go, there we go, and connect. Remember my choice. And we're back where we began. All right, hope that was helpful. I'd recommend Nostra.com if you wanna learn more about Nostra and I'll leave some links down below.